everyone and welcome back to Style Novice. Join me today as we make this DIY fabric bow clutch. To make your own DIY clutch you will need some fabric. You want it to be a thicker fabric such as a tightly woven cotton linen. For the strap you'll need one piece of fabric 35cm by 9cm. For the bow two pieces of 25cm by 12cm. For the bow knot, one piece at 12 centimetres by 5 centimetres. Two interior pieces and two exterior pieces, all measuring 18 centimetres by 12 centimetres. One 18 centimetre zip, an iron and ironing surface, and of course some matching thread. You'll want this to match the zipper. To start, iron the strap piece in half lengthways. Fold each edge into the middle crease. Fold this in half again, iron and sew along this seam. You want to also sew along the folded edge to match the other side. Now with the knot piece create a middle crease and fold each edge into this. Do not fold this piece in half. Sew along the outer edge on both sides. Fold this piece in half with the back side of the fabric facing outwards and sew across about one third in from the edge and trimming off any excess fabric. Turn inside out and pop aside for later use. Now onto the bow. Place one of your bow pieces face up on the table and place the other face down on top of this. Pin together and sew along each long edge. Turn the right way out and iron with both seams sitting on the sides. Gently pull this piece through the small knot we have just created and pop your newly created bow to one side. With both your interior and exterior pieces, fold and iron an outer edge onto each of these pieces, making sure that the edge is even on all bits. On your table, lay your zipper, zipper side down. Take one of your interior pieces and align the top edge you've just ironed in line with the bottom seam of the zipper, fabric facing good side up. Pin and sew along this line. With your second interior piece, repeat these steps. Next, take your first exterior piece and place this face up on your tabletop. To this, pin your bow, also face side up. Sew along both short ends of your exterior piece as close to the edge as possible and trim away any excess fabric on the sides of the bow. Take your zipper piece with the two interior pieces attached and place this good side down on your table. This means your zipper should now be facing up. Pin on your exterior piece with the bow and carefully sew along this edge. This is one of the edges that will be seen on the final product. Now do the same with the last remaining exterior piece on the other side. And back to the strap. Fold this piece in half and decide where and at what level you want your strap to sit on your finished clutch. Lay and pin in place on top of your bow. Now arrange the clutch so that both exterior pieces are now facing each other good side inwards with the strap sandwiched in between them and the interior pieces are arranged the same way on the opposite side of the zipper. Sew around all three edges of your exterior pieces. Pin the interior pieces in the same fashion but only sew along the long edge and one short edge, leaving the other short edge open and the zipper half undone. Once sewed, place your hand inside the open edge and turn the entire clutch the right way out using the half open zipper to pull any remaining fabric through. Arrange so the outer clutch is sitting as it would on the final product and pull the interior pieces out. Fold the loose edges in and sew along the open edge to complete your lining. Push inside being sure to poke around the corners to avoid bunching and your clutch is complete with hidden seams and inner lining. Don't forget to give us a big thumbs up if you enjoyed this tutorial and subscribe for more videos.